नमस्ते वेलकम टू दी वीडियो लेक्चर ऑन एटीट्यूड एंड ऑर्बिट कंट्रोल सिस्टम लर्निंग आउटकम एट द एंड ऑफ दिस सेशन स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू क्लासीफाई सेटेलाइट सब सिस्टम्स स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू एक्सप्लेन एटीट्यूड एंड ऑर्बिट कंट्रोल सिस्टम दीज आर द कंटेंट्स ऑफ वीडियो लेक्चर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग एटीट्यूड एंड ऑर्बिट कंट्रोल सब सिस्टम think and recall what is communication satellite and what are the types of satellite orbit a communication satellite is an artificial satellite that relays and amplifies radio telecommunications signals via a transponder it creates a communication channel between a source transmitter and a receiver at different locations on earth communication satellites are used for television telephone radio internet and military applications there are over 2000 communication satellites in earth orbit used by both private as well as government organizations satellite should be properly placed in the corresponding orbit after leaving it in the space it revolves in a particular way and serves its purpose for scientific military or commercial the orbits which are assigned to satellites with respect to earth are called as earth orbit the satellite present in those orbit are called earth orbit satellite we should choose an orbit properly for a satellite based on requirement for example if the satellite is placed in lower orbit then it takes less time to travel around the earth and there will be better resolution in an on board camera Similarly if the satellite is placed in a higher orbit then it takes more time to travel around the earth and it covers more earth surface at one time there are three types of earth orbit satellites first one is geosynchronous earth orbit satellite second one is medium earth orbit satellite and last one low earth orbit satellite in satellite communication there are two types of segments earth segment and space segment types of sub systems in space segment are attitude and orbit control sub system telemetry tracking command and monitoring sub system power sub system communication sub system and there is a separate antenna sub system or it can be combined with communication sub system control of the attitude of satellite is necessary so that the antenna which often have narrow beams are pointed correctly at the earth gravitational forces from the sun moon planets and planets will set up rotational moments on the satellite if it is not perfectly balanced also solar pressure acting on satellite antenna satellite body and solar cells may create rotational forces the earth's magnetic field also can produce forces on the satellite if there is net magnetic moment on a satellite as the satellite moves around the earth these forces vary cyclically through 24 hour period this tends to cause nutation of the satellite which must be damped out mechanically the variation in gravitational field cause not only attitude change but also acceleration on the satellite to change its orbit there are two ways to make satellite stable when it is in orbit and weightless spinning satellite and using momentum wheels there are two types first one is called spinning the satellite and second one using momentum wheels the entire body of satellites can be rotated at 30 to 100 rpm to create gyroscopic force which provides stability of the spin axis and keeps it pointing in the same direction such satellites are known as a spinners The best example of spinner satellite is the Huygens 376 which is also called Boeing 376 satellite is an example of spinner design Alternatively satellite can be stabilized by one or more momentum wheels this is called three axis stabilized satellite of which the Huygens 701 series is an example the momentum wheel is usually a solid metal disc driven by an electrical motor increasing the speed of the momentum wheel 
causes the satellite to precess in the opposite direction according to the principle of conservation of the angular moment as shown in figure the spinner consists of a cylindrical turn covered with a solar cells that contains the power systems and the rocket motors the communication system is mounted at the top of the drum and is driven by an electric motor in the opposite direction to the rotation of the satellite body to keep the antennas pointing towards the earth such system are called despern at an appropriate point in the launch phase the satellite is spun up by operating small radial gas small radial gas jets on the periphery of the drum then the design system operates so that the main telemetry tracking command and monitoring antenna could point toward the earth there are two types of rocket motors used on the satellite the bipropellant thrusters and arc jets or ion thrusters the fuel that is stored on a geo satellite that is geostationary satellite is used for two purpose to fire the apogee kick motor that injects the satellite into its final orbit and to maintain the satellite in that orbit over its lifetime in the three axis stabilized satellite one pair of gas jets is needed for each axis to provide rotation in both directions of pitch pitch roll and yaw with three momentum wheels rotation of the satellite about each axis can be commanded from the earth station by increasing or decreasing the appropriate of the momentum wheel speed which is called three axis stabilization the satellite must be stabilized with respect to the reference axis to maintain accurate pointing of its antenna beams when large narrow beams antennas are used the satellite may have to to be stabilized within 0.1 degree on earth axis this is typical on board control for spinner satellite the reference for the attitude control system may be the outer edge of the earth disk as observed with infrared sensors the sun or one or more stars and infrared sensors on the spinning body of a satellite can be used to north south control in pointing toward the earth orbit control system a geostationary orbit must be circular at a correct altitude on the equatorial plane if the orbit is not circular velocity change is to be made along the orbit for altitude correction z axis gas jets is used the inclination of an orbit increases about 0.85 degree per year most geo satellite are specified to remain within in a box of 0.05 degree and so in practice corrections are called a north south station keeping maneuver are made every 2 to 4 weeks to keep the error small it has become normal to split the uh, east west and north south maneuver so that an interval of 2 weeks the east west east west corrections are made first and then after 2 week the north south corrections are made these are references thank you